Last night, I got the scent. Nothing I can put my finger on, but I, I did see the helicopter. I got the sense that uh, some military fuck-ups, a cancer among the military that needs to be cleaned up, with uh, impersonators of yours truly, was BSing a lot of folks with deep pockets. And then afterwards, someone in a nice private, I believe, helicopter, don't know, I took a trip up here, was parked right over that that new complex there and we was showing them this and me in the window I just watched your photos coupon not apply by these uh, folks with those impersonators of yours truly uh, whoever you are come right through I'm here 24-7 knock on that door Answer that question this 4th of July with a check of your family's lifeline, a check of America's lifeline, 424-229-4140. Make that video, post that video, whatever you get, whatever boring thing you get when you don't get me, John Melton Brady. It's not going to be boring if you need the fireman, police, paramedics. So 9-11, Flight 93, check and post in 5 and answer the question, is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist? I know he sounds like a terrorist with that name, but we don't go by names for the fact that he grew up in Africa to be president of America. Answer the question with a simple check and post in five. This 4th of July. Ask and answer two of Jesus' questions with a video of your child, your family, your hijack lifeline. I'm John Milton Brady and I've been asking for a 9-11 Flight 93 check for over a decade without getting one. All soldiers, you protect America, this is part of it. Make that video of whatever you get when you don't get me. Of the military bases phone, police stations phone, fire stations phones all across America. See that phone you're making a video of is every child in America's lifeline to the fireman, police, paramedics. I have my answers to his is uh, Bill Gates a traitor to his country and is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist with not one 93 check call in a decade of asking? You get your answer. Come see me in person to tell me what your answer is. Members posted. Be a disciple of truth. Make a video of truth right now that affects your family. I'm John Milton Brady Milton, and I've been asking for 9-11 Flight 93 takes up America's lifelines of your lifeline for over nine and a half years, almost a decade now, and I've yet to get one. Those worried enough about hijacking a lifeline, as you call me, and hijacking a lifeline that who knows when else. When else, or where else, to who else, they might be hijacking your calls too. They're worried enough to alter phone records to cover it up. Make a video, you got the time stamp on your phone, you got the number dialed. When you can't reach me, oh yeah, you got proof. You got phone game. Be a part of making the world a better place. Make that video a proof today. Be a disciple of truth. Get that truth out that affects you in particular. Remember, it's your family's lifeline that is being hijacked when you try to call me. You don't know when else it won't be allowed to work properly. Who's it being hijacked by? Folks worried enough about it to alter phone records to cover it up? Cowards who are placing half place that cowardly Hussein in our White House right after we got attacked by a whole lot of angry, violent, deadly, cowardly Husseins. 
make a video of truth right now. 424-229-4140. Make that video, post that video. Be the reporter. Melton's imagery prepared as four by six photos. Yes, I am Melton, the son of a carpenter and married dad a carpenter, worked on skyscrapers. Mom Mary Ann. I am the son of a carpenter Mary. I get to make parables. Uh, I get to tell parables. And I also get to design beautiful imagery. I check it out on youtube.com slash DNFD series in the videos. And also uh, follow the links and you're going to find those 24,000 plus examples of my work. My graphic art. Also at uh, crashcomplex2.wixsite.com slash daffodilia and daffodilia.blogspot.com Oh, follow the links on both or hit the heart on the Wix site and you're going to find what I designed today. Hit the boxes over to the right on the Wix site and you will find 24,000 examples of my work. Make sure you download and burn them all to DPD, even the ones you don't want to print out, so that your friends can have a handsome bald guy. Keep them company with his graphic art. Wherever they might want to put me, on the nightstand, on the coffee table, it's up to them. Come see me to be in this imagery, and yes, you have to see me in person. Oh, there's the address. Because when you call me, 424-229-4140, your phone is hijacked. Make a video of that, and that one 911 flight 93 check in a decade of asking. That's a lot of man's censorship. We the people must be the reporters. Make that video if you hijack call to me and come see me in person. In Eagle Rock, a neighborhood in northern Los Angeles. Get your favorite flower designed as a forever flower. Never have to water it again. Print out a thousand times and yeah, you can use it for a nice mouse bed. And my new desktop image. Everybody. Make a video of your hijack call to me. I called a 911 flight 93 check of America's lifelines. I haven't gotten one of them in a decade of asking. You got the timestamp on your phone, you got the number dialed, and those folks hijacking your call to me are worried enough about it to alter phone records to cover it up. We have phone gate. Have video proof of that and have video proof of the hijacking of the American presidency. So we can get decent leaders in there. Try to call me in front of every network news anchor we got, every local news anchor. Why can't I reach this man? Everything's fake news compared to my family's life. I'm not working. Why aren't you covering the news? See if Aaron, second post in five. 424-229-4140. Make that video, whatever you get when you don't get me. Certify your mail as well, 4260 Eagle Rock Boulevard, apartment 409, Los Angeles, California, 90065. Not one, 911 flight 93 check of America's lifelines in a decade. We the people must be the reporter. Make that video, it takes just five minutes. 911 flight 93 check and post to five. You got the timestamp on the phone, you got the number dialed. You got phone gate. Melton's tabletop imagery. Print me out. Oh yeah, remember to make that video. Every time you hear a siren, make a video of someone else's phone not working as you try to call me. 424-229-4140. Whatever boring thing you get, phone ringing, air misses, busy signal. It is not going to be born. If you need the fireman, police, paramedics. And you have money out of your pocket uh, every day. You're calling up other customers. And you get that boring thing. The censorship is often boring.
but it's not going to be boring if you need that fireman, police, or paramedic. So make that video right now. 424-229-4140. And you got to print me up. That Daffodilia there. Or Melton Prince. 24,000 plus examples of my work, including those big fives. With my number and address to certify mail to. Not one 9-11 Flight 93 check and a decade of asking, no certified mail either. Make that video, post that video, whatever you get when you don't get me. We the people must be the reporters. I do that. Milton's tabletop imagery. Print me out as four by six photos. Where are you going to find Milton Prince? Dot blogspot.com for one. Price complex two dot weeksite dot com slash daffodilia. What's on my mouse pad here? Download, you're going to find 24,000 examples of these things here. My graphic card. You're going to find something you like there. Print me out and I'll keep you company. On that desk, on that uh, nightstand, on that uh, tabletop. And yeah, remember to burn DVDs for your friends. That's bizarre as hell. In the middle of a video, it's, it goes hazy. That's the devil on hand. Remember to burn those, uh, those DVDs for your friends so they can have Melton on their desktop. Their tabletop, uh, coffee table, dining room table, I'll take your pick. And make that video of America's Hijack Lifelines, 424 This is a very good uh, phone camera. When it is not working, it is intentional. It is those on hand who are hijacking a lifeline to me, 424 Make a video of how they affect you. It's not going to be boring, whatever boring thing you get, phone ringing, error message, business signal. It's not going to be boring if you need to fire and place paramedics. So make that video now. Folks, we the people must be the reporters. Whatever you boring thing you get when you don't get me. They're worried enough about to alter phone records to cover up the fact that they're hijacking your calls. That tells you something right there. Remember to ask that question. Ask an answer with a video of your hijack call to. I'm John Milton Brady. The question, Jesus' question is, is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist? Not one flight, 9-11 Flight 93 check of America's Lifeline. No calls in a decade or certified mail either. I have my answer. Pick up that phone, get yours. Post. And yeah, you can always tell when Hussein is in town. The devil lights up the sky. In that red. Here is Siren, 9-11, Flight 93, check and post in 5. Like the heroes of Flight 93, 97. Like they fought back physically, and they also fought back with their phones making calls in flight. We've all got phones that make videos now, so fight back against the terrorists. You can witness as you try to call me. 424-229-4140. I've been asking for a 911 Flight 93 check for a decade and I have yet to get one call. I'm John Melton Brady, 4260 Eagle Boulevard, Park 409, Los Angeles, California. 90065, ask and answer. Jesus' question about Barack Hussein Obama, the cowardly Hussein they placed in our White House right after we got attacked by a whole lot of cowardly Husseins. Make a video of America's Hijack Lifelines, do the job reporters aren't doing in front of them. Well, there is a helicopter up there. Here, a helicopter. Ask and answer Jesus' question. Is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist? I've got my answer. I've been asking for you to check America's lifelines with a 9-11, Flight 93, a check of America's lifelines. And I've yet to get one in a decade.
No certified mail, no non-certified mail, no FedEx, no UPS. Make a video of whatever you get when you don't get me. And post. We the people must be supported. Call me up in front of network news anchors, local news anchors, any and all in the public eye. Ask and answer that question with a video. And post and repost these five so that everyone else can ask and answer that question with a video as well. Remember, when you see a major company that is a major company because of their active participation in America's high tech lifelines, with a decibel law breaking fleet at 6 o'clock in the morning, and uh, still going at it with their active participation, you ask this question and answer it with a video. Up your hijack call to me, John Melvin Brady, not one. 9-11 flight 93 check in nine years of asking. That's a lot of men's census have conducted without fear of being covered by the evening news. And these folks here are making a whole lot of money at it. Because of it. So make that video of America's Hijack Life Lunch and post it. Ask that question, answer that question, and yeah, check and post and pop in front of Spectrum when they come to your home. Clarice has been called into her boss's office. He puts down an external hard drive with links to Melton's imagery and YouTube's. He tells Clarice, this 4th of July we are embarking upon cleaning up that cowardly Muslim threat that placed Hussein in our White House. Right after we got attacked by a whole lot of angry, violent, deadly, cowardly Husseins, they placed one in our White House. This man is a witness, John Melton Brady. Stone Cold Melton is. He is a witness to the hijacking of the American presidency. He has phone record proof. He has video proof of that. Study him, Clarice. And yes, we will be cleaning up the corrupt cowardly California cops as well this 4th of July. Get to it, guys. It's an external hard drive. Kennedy explains as he hands them out like candy. It holds two terabytes of Melton's imagery, including what you see on the labels. Make those videos if you hijack calls to me. 424-229-4140 Post and repost the fives you will find on these things as well. Telling everyone how to document America's hijack lifelines. Not one 93 check in a decade of asking. That's a lot of managed censorship conducted without fear of being covered by the evening news. We the people must be the evening news. Flight 93 check and post right now. Remember when you see some fireworks or just hear them, ask and answer that video question about Barack Hussein Obama. Well, there's some. Is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist? And answer, guys. A decade of John Melton Brady, Stone Cold Melton, son of Carpenter Mary, asking for 9-11 Flight 93 checks of America's lifelines and not getting one. It tells you Barack Hussein Obama is a terrorist. Make a video of that coward's Hijacking of America's Lifeline. What placed him in office? 424-229-4140. 4260, Boulevard, Apartment 409, Los Angeles, California, 90065. We certified mail. Not one bit of that in uh, that decade either. Make a video of what placed that cowardly terrorist, Barack Hussein Obama, in our White House to stay in our democracy. Make a video of your family's hijack life on your child. Hijack life on not one night three taking a decade of asking. And yes, lots of uh, phone gate templates uh, before uh, Trump's phone gate. 
And they were worried enough about this because my Tommy telling me how popular my Tommy Parable series and the Fast Stone slideshows with them are because the first 11 days I have gone through and blurred out the Skid Row address from a couple of years ago. And they went and removed the first 11 from my folders and then placed the others in with uh, out this blurred out, uh, meaning some personators on Skid Row need to be addressed. But to make that video of your hijack call to me, Osama's son in Osama our White House. Check your family's lifeline, America's lifelines, and mobilize. I'm John Melton Brady. I've been asking for 93 checks. 9-11 flight 93 checks of America's lifelines. That's you reaching me with that check of your phone, your lifeline. Not one in nine and a half years, almost a decade. Yes, the entire Hussein terrorist cell administration. Make that video of whatever you get when you don't get me. 424-229-4140. Post and repost my 93 check imagery and these big fives telling other Americans how to check and post the five and be the reporter. Make the video of whatever you get when you don't get me. Post it. Call me up in front of network news anchors, local news anchors, any and all in the public eye. Ask this question and answer it with a call. 424-229-4140. Post. Abigail and Morris have come across this image, along with a whole lot of other imagery from me, Melton, to John Melton Brady on a DVD. They've come across it, and Abigail says, the girls at the church were all talking about this. Why don't you call up that nice detective in our police department, you know, and ask him about it. So Morris does just that. And the detective says, oh, yeah, when they came through, we weren't sure if he was uh, president of the United States or the Shah of Saudi Arabia with all that Muslim stuff uh, with him. Uh, yeah, we're pretty sure the whole damn country witnessed that act of treason. Make that video of it and answer Jesus' question, is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist with your hijack call to me? Not one in a decade. See a police car? Check your family's lifeline by trying to call me. Ask and answer two questions. One, is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist? A decade of me not getting 193 check. 911 flight 93 check. I'm John Milton Brady. It uh, tells me, no certified mail, no non certified mail either. It tells me Barack Hussein Obama is a terrorist. Answer that question with a phone call. Answer this question with a phone call as well. Is Bill Gates a traitor to his country? I've had those 93 checks on his OneDrives and Googles as well. For a decade without one 93 check, I think I have my answer to that question as well as he breaks my computer's windows does. Check and post in five. Answer that que those questions. See a helicopter? Ask and answer Jesus' question. Is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist? A decade of me not getting one 9-11 flight 93 check of America's lifelines. I'm John Melton Brady. A decade of that tells me my answer. Oh, you get yours, and remember to post and repost my 93 check images so everyone can document America's hijack life. It takes five minutes. You got the timestamp on your phone, you got the number dialed. They're worried enough about a hijacking American's lifelines to alter phone errors covered up. Oh, yeah. The second question is Bill Gates, a traitor to his country with active participation in, in our hijack lifelines. Ask an answer with a call. A hijack call. Here is Siren. Ask and answer two questions. Is Barack Hussein Obama a terrorist? And is Bill Gates a traitor to his country? A decade of not getting one 
911 Flight 93 check call and watching Bill Gates cover that up with those 93 check videos on, including military children's burn unit, 93 check videos on his OneDrives. He's shown his active participation and also slowing down the computer industry. Well, that's nothing to do with your lifelines. Whenever you, you hear that siren, you check your lifeline. You call up in front of Bill Gates and all Microsoft employees currently breaking a second computer to cover up Barack Hussein Obama, the terrorist. Gates and Microsoft have broken another computer. It does not respond to having Windows Defender turned off so I can put my external hard drives on and work, do my imagery. Design my imagery. Upload my parables. Had to put on a flash drive last night to get it to work for my daily upload. Do a military children's burning at test. This is how this affects you. I've been asking for a 911 Flight 93 check for a decade. I haven't gotten one. No certified mail, no non certified mail. With those 93 checks I make often for the past decade on Bill Gates' Microsoft OneDrive as well as Google. Do a military children's burn unit test in front of Bill Gates and ask him, why are you being a traitor to America, threatening our safety, our family's lifelines? Get his reaction to Jesus' question about Barack Hussein Obama and post. All of it. We are in the middle of church Sunday morning and Father Olfactory holds up his cell phone. He says, not only is this my lifeline, it's all of your lifelines. Yeah, I know you got your own phones. But I want you to see this as the entire church's lifeline to the firemen, the police, the paramedics. I want you to see this as every child's lifeline to the firemen, the police, and the paramedics. I'm going to hand my cell phone out. I want it back at the end. And I want you to make a video of you trying to call John Melton Brady 424-229-4140 and getting religious censorship that also affects our lifelines you can't tell him what you believe what we believe you can't ask what he means by faith and that religious censorship that yes can place someone with a Muslim name in our White House right after we got attacked by a whole lot of Muslims I know we can all be PC, but there's a limit when it affects our safety. This is religious censorship. You can't call up Melton to tell him what you believe or ask what he believes. You can't tell him about that saint. You'd like to see an image designed around. That religious censorship conducted by zealots is affecting our lifelines and we need to do something about that so pick up all of your phones oh I know you've got them with you I've seen you checking your messages and make a video of the church's lifeline being hijacked as you try to call this man John Milton Brady and you don't know when else that phone won't be allowed to work. And he hands out that lifeline and everybody <coughs> makes it quick. Oh, check and post in five. That's how long it takes. Five minutes. You make the video with your phone of someone else's phone. Not working as you're trying to call me. 424-229-4140. Turn around and you let them make the video of your lifeline being hijacked. Those hijacking are lifelines. Conducting, conducting that zealotry, religious censorship, they are worried enough about getting caught hijacking your lifeline to alter phone records to cover it up. What's the way around that? How do you catch that? Well, you make a video of your call to me, 424-229-4140. You got the number you're dialing on the phone. You got the timestamp on your phone. And you can go to youtube.com slash DNFD series. That's DNFD, S-E-R-I-E-S. And you can look for the Melton's Call Log playlist. Videos I've made of this phone in my hand making this video. 
And no, not one 911.93 shake in a decade of asking. But if you tried, uh, that last uh, video I put up there was a month ago when it covered two years. If you tried to call in that time, yeah, that's your phone not showing up on records, your lifeline. Now, I think you can understand that those who are doing that zealotry at the highest level of America, if your phone's not allowed to work in an emergency, because you're a Christian, you're not the big name in your business, you live in the wrong part of town, your phone's not allowed to work in that critical time when seconds count. It's not just about complete censorship, it can be second. Taking your life or the member of a family, their life. Make that video of whatever you get when you don't get me, it's going to be boring. A phone ringing, an error message, a busy signal. If you get to leave a message, I don't get it. And yeah, you don't show up on that call log. Some of you out there can get those call logs. Do that. Make that video from the police station's phone. Of the police station's phone, of the fire station's phone, of the military base's phone, all across America and beyond. You defend America. This is part of that. Make that video of what you get when you don't get John Milton Brady. Oh yeah. The Trump's phone gate here. Been doing that for years. And I went to go form my Tommy parables. My fun stuff. Some like it. Some don't. But I went to form it with slideshows of every image I designed this month and a year ago this month the first Tommy parable gets the, uh, the first of the month from 2018, 2017, 2016 and the imagery from 2016 one of these templates was stolen right in front of me I had to uh, kind of block out the old Skid Row address I had to live on Skid Row because of the censorship of my lifeline. Sure Gates livelihood as well guys. As well as mine. When you get that boring thing, phone ringing, air message, busy signal. Yeah. When you call up countless other customers and you get that. You don't know if they're not there. Or maybe Gates, if you're in the computer industry, is supposed to get that business so only he can reach them by phone. Same with Spectrum. And uh, the cable and internet business. Make that video whatever you get when you don't get me, because it always gets back to that lifeline for you and your family and everyone else around you. See that phone is every child in America's lifeline to the fireman, police, paramedics. Make a video being hijacked. Tell everyone else to do the same. Call me up in front of network news anchors, local news anchors, any and all in the public eye, like mayors, governors, senators. Get everyone weighing in on dangerous censorship in America. The address of certified mail to is out here in Eagle Rock, a neighborhood in northern Los Angeles. Uh, oh, it's a whole lot better than uh, Skid Row. It uh, smells a lot better uh, as well. Make that video. Whatever you get when you don't get me, post it. And tell everyone at church to do the same. Hand out those big fives. You saw one small five on the flash drive a while back. It's probably coming up again. You can find at uh, vote-truth.blogspot.com or a lot of these sites that have 24,000 examples of my work, my imagery design. A work I don't get paid for. Download those 24,000, print it me out, I'll keep you company on that nightstand, on that tabletop, on that desk. Oh, they're all prepared as four by six photos. If you want something else, you're gonna have to look around. Someone in your town's bound to have it. Then I skip over it. I think it's at the beginning there, the big five flash drive. They come as four to a four by six print which is a little bigger than the flash drive. Two to a four by six photo means uh, that's 15 cents for two good size 
photos of a five that tell everyone how to make a video of religious censorship in America that affects our lifeline. Aim high, fly, fight, win. Semper Fidelis, this we will defend, defend America by making a video of our hijacked lifeline. Pick up that phone, make that video. 424-229-4140 takes just five minutes to do the job reporters aren't doing because they're placing a buffoon wrestling guy in our White House. That's comic relief after, yes, an attack on America from Hussein. From the inside and the outside. Make that video, post that video, come see me in person. And yes, be the reporter. 424-229-4140. Make the video, whatever boring thing you get when you don't get John Milton Brady. Then, uh, I'm trying to lose them like a bad habit. Then, uh, hit that YouTube icon. Or Instagram or Twitter or Facebook, a hundred more. Be the reporter. Tell everyone our lifelines are hijacked as they place in our White House. We need to do something about that. Oh, I don't play favorites. Truth is the son of a carpenter and Mary's favorite. Yes, I'm the son of a carpenter and Mary. A dad of carpenter worked on skyscrapers and Mom Mary, yeah. I'm the son of a carpenter and Mary. I get to tell parables and also design graphic art of truth as well. Those are the sites. You can see them on the flash drive even. YouTube.com slash DNFD series. Christ Complex links has years and years of YouTubes and me asking for that first 911 flight 93 check. And this is the one that doesn't have vote dash truth. I think it goes right there. But that's a place you can find as well as ChristComplex2.Wixsite.com slash Daffodilia over my eyes there. And there's the address, apartment 409, 4260 Eagle Rock Boulevard, apartment 409, Los Angeles, California, 90065. Certify your mail and, yeah, come see me. I will travel. Show me the perfect place to build. Jesus is a Michael house. What's Jesus is a Michael house? Well, I can't tell you. Because of the kind of Hussein religious censorship that is hijacking your lifeline as you try to call me to tell me what you believe. Come see me in person to overcome that dangerous religious censorship that affects our lifelines. Factory holds up his phone in the middle of church and he says, This phone is your lifeline right now. If one of you gets sick, I'm going to use it to call the paramedics, the firemen, even, the police. It's a convent's lifeline during the week. It's my lifeline during the week as well. I'm going to hand this phone out to you. I want each and every one of you to make a video of it being hijacked as you try to call John Melton Brady with that. He's been asking for 93 checks, 911 flight 93 checks for over a decade, and he has yet to get one. No certified mail about those 93 checks as well. No FedEx, no UPS. Make a video of our hijack lifeline so we can take America back from the dangerous people who are worried enough about hijacking our lifelines to alter phone records to cover it up. The sea of vapor trail, 9-11, flight 93, check and post in five. Takes us five minutes to make a video of your hijack lifeline as you try to call me, John Milton Brady. Uh, you can certify your mail to me as well. I haven't gotten any certified mail or 93 checks. That's you calling me. In a decade of asking, whenever you see that vapor trail in the sky, let it remind you to check and post in five. Be on the side of those driving the tanks, the jeeps, the jets, the side of children and true. Make a video. See that phone in your hand? You're making a video of with your phone? As every child in America's life to the firemen, police, paramedics, and make a video of being hijacked. Post. We the people must be the reporters. They're not doing their jobs. All cops across America take back our country from the cowardly Husseins that attacked us from the outside and attacked us from the inside with that cowardly Hussein they placed in our White House.
Make that video of the police station's phone not working as you tried to call me, John Milton Brady. And ask Bill Gates and every employee Microsoft has what is your very active part. In America's Hijack Lifelines, they've broken another computer remotely with the damn Windows update. Ask him what's your part in that. I think it has something to do with reminding me of the Saudi Arabian city by the sea of Santa Monica, so check and post in front of them. I have to upload from a laptop and use a flash drive as well. That's uh, me living in that uh, Hussein's a little rapier, working for the Saudi Arabian city by the sea, uploading in the libraries. In case you're wondering why you've seen this, it'll be until I can literally find the time to look up uh, this place. Uh, Dr. Misa down the street is engaged in what I call Great Wall of Evil, coming biomethods, uh, sleep deprivation kind of stuff. And she uh, is prescribing a 230 pound man, me, a one tab, and reprimanding me, making it very personal. If I'm back in there in a, a month to get more pain medicine which she's not prescribing, neglecting her Hippocratic Oath. If I'm not back in, if I'm back in there in a month, she doesn't want to see me back in there in a month. And yes, she's under prescribing. I'm 230 pounds. Oh, the uh, cops have requested on uh, the 4th of July with chemical methods here at Teague Terrace. Sleep deprivation methods as well. Muslim methods with the uh, Corrupt, cowardly California moron. Hatred from down below. But back to Dr. Misa. You won't have to believe a thing. I mean, that's just the way she prescribed. I'm looking for any doctor who can get me some relief from this intense pain. And I had used uh, them as a home health when I had the wound opened up a little bit here at Eagle Rock. I had talked to uh, uh, the nurse there, and I'm hoping to hear back from her. If not, I'll call and see if I can get a decent doctor who can prescribe pain medicine, who can get me to sleep at night. Same, wa same way she prescribes uh, a 90-pound uh, female or male. She's going to prescribe for the same for uh, a me, and be condescending about it. So. 9-11, flight 93, check and post in five in front of Dr. Misa, Martha Misa, down the street. She can reach me by phone. If you can't, you need to know what Dr. Misa knows to be an active participant in America's Hijack Lifeline. Because her lifeline works, she'll get to that hospital. If your child is in need of medical attention and because you're a real Christian yours is not allowed to work properly something you need to find from Dr. Mead to ask her why do you actively participate in America's Hijack Lifelines what is your part in that 424-229-4140 try to call me in front of Dr. Mead apparently the computer is not working today so let me go show you the uh, the question you can ask and answer with a phone call, not one in over a decade. A check of America's Lifeline, see that phone is every child in America's Lifeline to the department, place paramedics, make a video of being hijacked. And ask all involved, especially those like Dr. Miza who have become very personal in their involvement. Some folks, yeah, I'm sure there's some folks with LAC, USC, Keck Medical who can reach me by phone or just good doctors or good nurses and they look at this Chinese computer of mine and they uh, they don't know anything about American Psychic Life they get, if they get angry if they have a story to tell yeah that's uh, no Stephen I gotta look out for number one that is a sign that they are an active and participant in American Psychic Life he says Toronto if they say, damn, you should be able to reach John Melton Brady. He hasn't had the 9-11 flight by 3 check in nine years, 10 years of asking, a decade. Uh, give Dr. Misa that test and ask her what is your very personal part in American Psychic Life Plans and Post. I spent a sleepless night, night last night in a lot of pain because of her. And I'd like her to answer that question personally. And 